birthday, Patty. Thank you. Thank you. Thank Are you, you very excited? Tonight's a big oh night. I'm so excited. Not only David came, but I'm excited for Fine Francie. So, yeah, let's have you introduce this sexy man right here. Um, this is my boyfriend, David Krause. He's from the OC. I listen to Slade and Tamara and Vicky and Gretchen. They've been bitching at me for years. I need an OC guy. So, so you went down there to check it out. Well, actually, he picked me off of Plenty of Fish. We met online. Very nice. And what was your first date like? Um, it was really cool. We went to Killer Shrimp in Marina Del Rey. Very yeah. cool. So yeah. tell me a little bit about Patty Knows. Patty Knows is going to be amazing. It's relationship advice, whether you're 18 or 100, and it's everything from being single to being married. So it's everything you need, your one-stop shopping resource for relationships. Perfect. Yeah. Now, what did you get Patty for her birthday? Oh, he got me, you know, I'm not wearing it. Like, show it what you're wearing. He got what he got. So It's a soulmate bracelet. It's oh a Tibetan, God. it's a Tibetan Buddhist bracelet. That the, very nice. That, um, we're very spiritual. The Buddhists make it for us. Well, I was going to ask you what your best gift is, but I'm assuming That's it's my this. best. Well, actually, it's him. It's not really a bracelet. So there <laughs> That's you go. a good gift. We can't talk about that. That's like X-ray. <laughs> now you're filming season six right now. How's that going? Oh my God, it's exhausting. But we have so many exciting things. We have Denise Richards on, James Scott from Days of Our Lives. We've got Plumpty Dumpty. She comes back. <laughs> Very excited about that. Steve Sanagati, who's here tonight. A lot of cool things, a lot of fun twists and turns. Very interesting uh, clients this season. So Very would you set Denise up with? Well, we didn't set Denise up, we set Denise's father up. Oh. Yes, it was. We had fix up the exes on one episode. We're doing this whole little elimination thing. We have a lot of fun stuff happening. It's a very different show this season, and you also get to see my private life with me and David. So it's really fun. Very cool. So yeah. what do you guys like to do? Um, I can't say the X-ray. <laughs> <laughs> I went right to them. Like okay. I heard a little okay. bit about one of your gifts. It's a oh, maybe you haven't gotten it yet. Sorry, okay, tell, okay tell me. I don't know. <laughs> Um, we, we really, we're very simple. I mean, he's a sports guy, he's an ex-baseball player. You can talk. Uh, you're doing a great job. Have you comments ahead. from you? We've been having a great time. Yeah, really. going to museums. We went to museums. Uh, we're both in photography, so we went yeah. to the Herb Ritz exhibit. And very now we're probably cool. going to do the Helmet Lang thing. Uh, help, excuse me, Helmet Newton thing. And uh, we're seeing the designer. And we just, like, we, we, we're very simple. You know, so we're going to see some of these dates? Yes, yeah, we're actually going to go on a really cool date. I can't say the first date, but the second one, we're going to go to Vegas. Cool. Yeah. That's fun. Yeah, a lot of fun stuff. Now I heard recently you've set up Dina Lohan. Well, actually, I've been set her up. She's called me. Bravo! We want her and Lindsay on the show. Sherry, are you listening? So um, I'm going to set her up. As soon as she starts dying down with Lindsay's filming, Lindsay's like kicking it right now. She's momager right now. I'm going to start to hook her up. Yeah. Who would you set Lindsay up with? Um. Wow. That's a <laughs> handful of stuff. Um. Too bad Colin Firth is, sing is not single anymore because I always thought those oh, two would exactly. make. I thought the two of them would knock it out, you know? I need like, like, and then all the good ones are taken, you know? Ryan, both Ryans are taken. Who's left? Who's yeah, single? I mean, I want Who both Ryans, right so. Now? Who's single? <laughs> Jesse Metcalf's single? I just watched Dallas List and I'm obsessed. Um, I don't know. I gotta find who's single. Maybe tonight I'll find somebody. Okay. okay. Well, tell people to start calling you for yeah. Lindsay. Gavin DeGraw, maybe? <laughs> My buddy Gavin? Gavin. Lindsay, I might hook him up. Well, now the biggest news of all, you are adopting. Can you tell me where you are in the process? What it is, is I'm adopted, and I'm thinking of adopting. When we first met, we were talking about it because he has two kids. So we're discussing it. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Do you think that'll happen anytime soon? I mean, we're going to research it. It's not a fast process. We thought about adopting older children, so we're going to look into it. Denise gave me a 411. Um, a lot of people have adopted to give me education. I want to adopt American and older. I don't want the baby. I want like a five-year-old. So. Get them at once they're out of the terrible twos and such. The truth is I don't want a potty trained. <laughs> so, 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 it's okay. So. Like, I need one who's already trained. I need one who's in school and is with my schedule. No, I'm only kidding. Um, I just want the older children who don't get a home. They don't get a sh they don't get advances to meet parents who want them. It's really sad as they get older and then when they're 18 they're thrown out of the system, foster care, the whole thing. So. Well, good luck with that. Good luck with him. Good luck with the blog and everything. Happy birthday. Thank you. Thank you. Hi, guys.